Roethlisberger underneath center. Motion by Sanders. Gives the ball. It goes to Bell. He got drilled by T.J. Ward. Oh, Ward almost took the handoff. Browns fans, I'm now joined by T.J. Ward. T.J., thank you for taking time out, and happy Thanksgiving to you. How was your Thanksgiving? Happy Thanksgiving. It was great. Spent it with family, some teammates, some friends. Um, had a good time. T.J., as you guys prepare to face the Jacksonville Jaguars this coming Sunday, how was the week of preparing? Our week of preparation went well. I think we were dialed in, focused, um, focused on correcting some of the issues we had last week and, you know, just getting back on track. And after last week's game, emotions were running high naturally, and you made mention how the Browns, after two divisional, tough two divisional losses, how the Browns aren't quite there just yet. But what's it going to take for the Browns to get over this hump? You know, I think the frustration came from having a good team and not getting it done and, you know, having the capability and not you know, fulfilling that. But I think we're on the right path. And if we continue to play, you know, at an elite level consistently, consistently, then, you know, those are the, show, the signs that show. And until then, then you know, we're just going to be an average team. Win or lose, you can always learn from a game and you can take the positives and move forward. And with five games left, what can you take from last week and carry forward? I think you know, the maturity comes from taking what we um, failed to do last week and making those corrections and coming back, bouncing back the next week and improving. You know that's the maturity, and that's the show. And you know that brings consistency, and consistency you know, breeds great teams when you're consistently doing things the right way. You guys got a tough challenge against the Jacksonville Jaguars this coming Sunday. From looking at the film study and watching these guys from an offensive perspective, what have you seen? You know they're going to capitalize on. Um, the things you don't do so well. So uh, uh, I anticipate them doing some quick passes, getting the ball out of the quarterback's hands quickly so we don't get to the quarterback. Some trick plays, you know, trying to use our aggressive against us. And running the ball, you know, they ran the ball pretty well the last couple of weeks with Maurice Jones Drew, and he's done a great job. And I think those were the three things they're going to try to do against us. Play as hard as you can with your heart and soul. And do your job. Most important, we'll come out here with this dub at the end of the day. That's it. No responsibility. Trusting your teammate, everybody gonna do that. Dogs on three. One, two, three. Dogs. Over the course of the season, you really have emerged as one of the leaders within this locker room. How much do you embrace that role as being a leader? No, I fully embrace that. You know, that's just a sign you know, that your team, teammates have respect for you and they you know, respect the way you come about work every day, the preparation you put in, and you know, and you've done it from day one. So I really appreciate that, and you know, I'm trying to step into that role completely. And you know, I trust my teammates, and it shows that they trust me. Choice is the running back. Shotgun snap. Tool back to pass. Throws to the middle. Pick off, and there he goes down the sideline. 